Now, a lot of people get confused between the background and the literature review. How are these two um, sections related but also different? And I chose this image of a, a man straddling two cliffs because it can sometimes feel like these two sections are very far away. So let's discuss how they're related but also distinct pieces of your paper. So as mentioned previously, the background summarizes prior knowledge about a topic, previous knowledge. And you may have even asked yourself, well, isn't that the point of the literature review? And if you have asked yourself this question, trust me, you're not alone. Many researchers do become confused about the differences between the background and the literature review. So how are they similar? Well, both the background and the literature review talk about current scientific knowledge in a research area and they underscore gaps that need to be addressed or unresolved questions. However, these two sections are different. How are they different? For research papers, it is normal for the background and the literature review, the literature review to be combined and presented together. So sometimes these two sections are combined into one, and that's okay. However, for dissertations or for a thesis, the background and literature review might be presented as separate sections. However, in order to write each section effectively, it's important that you have a clear understanding of how each section is different. And if you are ever um, unsure whether you should write the background and literature review as separate sections or combine them, um, I would recommend contacting your academic advisor or a trusted colleague um, to review your paper and consult them um, because sometimes the answer is not so clear cut. Sometimes you have a choice. Um, it could really depend on the goal of your paper um, and also the length. You know, for example, some a lot of journals have limitations on how long your paper can be. So by combining the background and the literature review, you may be able to make your paper shorter in order to meet the word length requirement of a given academic journal. Mm -hmm.